and I'm surprised that I actually got this item and I'm even more surprised that I actually like this item a lot. Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Aynora if you're new to my channel. If you're my subscriber, thank you so much for coming back and watching my videos. Today it's going to be an exciting video and it's going to be an unboxing. It's an item that I never thought I would buy and never thought that this item will be useful at all for in my uh, handbag collection. It is a bag, definitely. This item I really, really love for the color. It's an amazing color. I really like everything about this item. Just the, the combination, the leather, the style, the hardware, and the color is even like the most stunning color and I think you guys know what color that would be and the item came in this little box and I guess you guys know uh, what it is already because this size of the of the box might tell you what it is already and it is a we call it a bag but I think it's going to be a, I think it's I think it's the official name is small leather good but it is I consider this a bag because anything that can fit my phone which is iPhone 13 not 13 I wish <laughs> 11 Pro Max I don't wish actually I don't really hunt for the latest iPhone anymore I used to I used to want to always get the latest iPhone but now I'm with 11 Pro Max and I'm totally fine with it and yeah so this uh, fits my iPhone and it came in the fashion file dust bar because I bought it from fashion file and it's actually from the uh, couple years ago pre uh, uh, collection so it, it's actually this is the, the the original dust bar and it's this really nice uh, like a suede uh, feeling and the item is Ta-da! Ta -da. And the item is the wallet on a chain um green reissue uh, version wallet on a chain in this beautiful green color. I don't know uh, my video uh, my camera is actually showing it like a little bit bluish and like a turquoise, but it's more like a really, really uh, true green color. Yeah, it is a true green color. As you guys know that I do not have any reissue in my Chanel collection, I never understood a reissue at all. It just looked uh, like a simple bag with no brand at all and I didn't really understand it. So yeah, I never, never understood the reissue version of the Chanel flat bag. Uh, it never interested me at all, but recently I really was looking for something small, something to go um, like day, daily if I'm going without kids any somewhere or for like a going out bag. I'm always browsing through the fashion file, of course, I well, what I do in my free time. And I saw this beautiful green reissue wallet on the chain. I actually saw the mini reissue flap in the exact combination, but somehow the reissue mini flap has this like, mm, the edges, do really wear really badly. I'm actually gonna pop in a picture how the edges are like kind of they they fold really uh, weirdly. Like they they actually the shape actually does over time changes and it does get wrinkly. Uh, like especially the edges. Like here the edge is actually like a flexible uh, leather, but on the other mini flap the reissue version is not a flexible and it just looks a bit weird uh, and I really I thought to go for the mini reissue in the same um, uh, combination but I went with them with the wallet on the chain first of all I don't have a wallet on a chain from Chanel at all I do have a very similar size from Dior 
and it's very similar but I think the Dior one is a lot thicker um, and I do love the Dior version the wallet on the chain and um, I do use it like sometimes or casually sometimes when I go out I use it so I was really thinking of Getting something as uh, small like this, but in a pop of color, uh, I really, really like fell in love. And the detail I actually really love because uh, look at the leather. It is a grained, like aged uh, calfskin leather. Not grained, sorry. It's an aged, like it's a aged uh, calfskin leather. So it has a little bit of wrinkles, like a little bit wrinkly, and it does feel a very very like scratch prone very um i think it looks very it's, it is very durable it, i do feel uh, a lot more durable than the lambskin and i really like ha how it has a mona lisa pocket as the original reissue bag and i really like the lock i never liked this lock because of i don't know i really preferred the the CC lock that original flap has. I really like this flap a lot, a lot than this, but I do like the understated lock on the reissue now. Um, and I really like how the wallet on the chain on the reissue version has this lock, like actual lock instead of like the magnetic uh, version. So I actually can like, so this one is a lot more like you can actually lock it instead of having it magnetic and instead of like looking for that magnet and look in sometimes i actually heard that the wallet on a chain on the magnet does uh open up um on like a few times and it's actually not safe so i do love that it has a like a full lock and when you open up I still have the fashion file um, price tag, not price tag, but the tag. And when you open it up, you have everything. You have that little like hidden pocket, and then uh, there's like a very like six slots of like card holder, and then like a, the bigger compartment here. It has another compartment right here, and it has a zipper compartment. Uh, it has its uh, authenticity card and it starts from 28, which is from uh, a year 2019. So it's been two years since this um, been out. And then it has another pocket here. It has an, actually a price tag, original price tag. So yeah, it is in the brand new uh, condition. And um, if you guys are wondering why I buy sh uh, fashion file items, because I do um, I do not hunt for the latest bags, like sh latest Chanel collection or latest Dior collection. I don't really hunt it out, hunt it for like the it bag. I do take my time. I do. Um, I, I buy, I genuinely buy whatever speaks to me, whatever works for my style, whatever I like at that moment. Right now, so I have this green face, that's why I really, really like looking on like fashion file and like, uh, and type in the search box, green bags or green Chanel bags. And then I find something that I really like. Unfortunately, I cannot go to Chanel, to the boutique, and say, I like green bags, show me green bags. And then this, right now, the collection that they have does not have any green bags. So that's why I go to Fashion File and look for the bag that I'm looking for. And I find something really special that have been probably in the previous collection, which I don't care. And I really love it. It's so cute. And that's why I really like it. And I did get uh, for... Um, original retail price I think it's actually I got actually got it for like few like I don't think it was like $50 less or something as it's because uh, it's uh, originally it, this was 2500 and I got it for 2400 something so which is really cool and the most most favorite in this uh, wallet on a chain is I love is the chain. Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at the chain, guys. 
Look at this beautiful chain. It's just amazingly beautiful. I actually want to take this chain and put it on my neck and actually wear it as a necklace. But this one is just an amazingly beautiful chain. I never, never, I mean, I always looked, um, like I admired the reissue, the, like just for the chain and this, this like gold and green color looks amazing together i just really love this uh, combination and i really, really like how this bag is tiny but it can fit my 11 pro max iphone with the cover it actually fits perfectly in the bag look at this guys it perfectly fits because it does open up here and it does easily lock you see guys and I can actually uh, put my cards in here and I can fit like my lipstick which is my favorite Gucci lipstick my favorite color I can fit my lipstick here and I can fit like a little um, perfume and look at this guys so I have my phone, my perfume, my lipstick, and then I can easily put a lots of cards in it. I can put even more. As you guys see, there's a lots of space on this side. I can fit so much. For the small bag, I can fit very, 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 I mean, the, all the essentials that I need if I'm going out, if I'm running errands and need a small bag. I do love these smaller bags for like to put inside my bigger bags or if I'm traveling and, I'm, and I need like a, a fun um, going out bag for like dinner. This will not take any, any, any space in my um, luggage and it's actually will uh, fulfill my day bag and as my night bag so i really love it so much what do you guys think i'm actually going to show you guys how it looks on me but first of all let's go ahead and compare this color green to my chanel boy green bag for just a color comparison this is my uh, green boy bag in the chevron with the caviar gold uh not gold sorry this is champagne gold hardware it's a shiny um champagne gold hardware and this is the reissue which is also green but it has this turquoise blue undertone and uh, reissue in the capskin aged leather in the shiny gold hardware so yeah this is I did think that this one would be so very close to this green color. This is like a very warm green tone and this is like a cooler green um, back. So yeah, what do you guys think? Amazing, right? I mean, I think I don't need any more green bags. I think I have enough green bags. I have like probably four four green bags already the other two are very dark green so it's like almost like not green but i think these two green colors are amazing and i fulfill my green obsession now i will also show how i will wear you can wear this as a clutch you can put this strap inside the bag and wear it and wear it as a clutch and wear it as a clutch you can also wear this bag as a crossbody I am 5'7 so it does um, lay like it does look good on my height I am 5'7 and it looks pretty good it's not too low and it's not too high up it actually is a great uh, chain length and uh, you can also wear this do like this just twist the strap on the inside and then wear this bag as a like a little shoulder bag which is actually great 
great length. Yep. And I'm gonna take off this um, because I'm gonna definitely keep it. So yeah, what do you guys think? It's so beautiful. I'm actually gonna show it from a close up. And it's just amazing. Amazing little wallet on the chain. Never, I was never a fan of uh, this lead, like, I was never a fan of wallet on a chain, but I really love it. I just love this uh, combination. It's the perfect combination. Um, the color is amazing. I don't know, it, in, in life, this is more green, but in the video I see, it's more like a turquoise um, bluish but I do not see any blue in it in the real life. I think the wallet on the chain uh, in the reissue is actually great. I have seen the reissue in even like a larger sizes, the wear and tear, like the, the, they do lose the structure so badly that it does look so awful. I'm gonna show the pictures here that I've seen. That's why I think I'm always, I was always like disliking the reissue even like the style because of the wear and tear is like the structure wear was horrible so i i am glad that i added the wallet on a chain version where i'm not going to see any structure wear it's actually a great like i feel like it's actually the great option from the reissue um collection so yeah so hopefully this video was fun to watch. Uh, let me know if you guys want a like a comparison video between like the the Dior wallet on a chain or something else. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully this video was fun to watch. Uh, please subscribe to my channel, like my videos, and go follow me on Instagram where I will be showing all my bags and how I style them. Thank you so much. Bye bye.